Hello, yeah, my name is William Jones of the Pachinat First Nation. I'm an 80-year-old elder there. I'm here to spread the word of saving what's left of the old growth. The old growth is the untouched original virgin timber that has never been logged. There is very little of it left, just remnants of our ancient forests. What's left, particularly the Ferry Creek watershed, that happens to be one of our holiest mountains. What's left has to be not touched, period. Customarily, our people, the Pachinat First Nation, looked upon the forest as all old growth. Now we're wanting to save what's left of it for the children's future and their spiritual needs. Trees. Please don't cut the trees down. We love trees. Don't cut them down. I love trees. I respect Mother Nature, old growth trees. It's kind of like, to me, it's like elders, but like to the world, like the earth. It's very important, I say, for me to keep uh, to keep them standing. So it's uh, a loggerhead situation that our government doesn't seem to be wanting to address. It is time for change and to recognize that climate change is here, the emergency is here, we have to change our course right now and save these incredible forests that are full of biodiversity that's come down from 10,000 years ago and we will never see these forests again. Anyone who's walked in an ancient forest and had that feeling. I remember my niece when she was much younger, we took her into the Carmana Valley. She said, I can breathe in here. And they, they do put out the oxygen and you actually can and it, it stills the soul. You see how rich it is for the salmon streams, for the wildlife, for everything. And the, the creatures we can't see, the smaller insects. There's a lot of endangered species in British Columbia. We need to protect these ecosystems. And for ourselves and our future because of the climate emergency. That ecosystem is absolutely critical to protect carbon and to protect us. And it's going to take a lot of public action and outrage because this government just lies. They don't intend to protect anything. They're madly cutting the best of the remaining ancient forest on Vancouver Island right now, which I know about, and parts of the coast. Shame, absolute shame. Delay is destruction. We must stand up for our forests wherever we can, in every way that we can. This is a message to the Premier. We are coming. We have drawn a line in the ground to save the old growth forest. All right? Something I want to remind everybody, when you clear cut a forest, it's not just the trees that go. We kill all the animals. This is genocide. They are the elders. 
They are the ones that provide protection, food and security for millions of lives and species. How can we stand back and tear down an ancient mother? This is not right. This is wrong. This is a defining moment in each person's lives to make a choice. First Nations and Canadians from all walks of life are coming together. This is not a time to stand down. This is a time to speak up and speak up loudly. We are guardians to put the brakes on old growth logging once and for all to end the toxic legacy of colonial resource extractive violence on the land. The future of our own children is hanging in the balance. invite all people to come up to the old growth forest, spend time there and bring your kids and show people what beauty and grandeur this world has. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs>